you guys, it's your girl Keiko Olingus with another tech fix for all my fellow gear addicts. Now, as you may have seen in previous episodes of the show, I'm a MacBook user and I love this guy. I edit with it, I blog with it, and you can imagine whatever else. Pervs. However, one problem that I encounter when using this guy in the field is that battery life can definitely be limited, especially when you're fighting for outlets at the local coffee shop or have access to no external power in an airplane. Now I know that the newer lines of MacBooks can last upwards of 10 hours, but if you have a battle-tested one like my 2011 MacBook Pro here, then an extra boost in battery power would be welcome. Now with all the external battery chargers for smartphones, tablets, and even PC laptops out there, you would think that surely there would be one available for MacBooks. Well, there was. The HyperMac External Charger by Sanho Digital. But being that Apple has a legal hold on their proprietary MagSafe power adapter, they didn't take too kindly to another company making their own product out of it. Fast forward to now, Sanho has since come up with an alternate solution with the Hyperjuice Magic Box, which is essentially a DIY kit that allows you to modify the MagSafe power adapter that you already own and turn it into an external MacBook charger. Now originally, I was planning to go all MacGyver on you guys by doing all the wire cutting and twisting and so on, but Sanho was so excited for us to show this to you that they actually did it for us. But nonetheless, it actually is a fairly simple five minute process and we have a link to a step-by-step -step video that runs you through the entire setup on our blog. So since all the work has been done for us, let me at least show you what we're working with. So before getting into the magic box itself, the external battery pack that we're working with is the Hyperjuice 1.5. Depending on what MacBook you're using, they have hyperjuices ranging from 60 to 222 watt hours. So obviously, once we have our magic box set up, we will be connecting it to the hyperjuice battery right here. And as you can also notice, there are two USB ports here that also allows you to simultaneously charge or power up USB devices such as smartphones and tablets. As for the Magic Box Kit itself, it comes with two Magic Boxes, the first of which allows you to charge the Hyperjuice battery using your pre-existing MacBook power adapter. And the second one allows you to connect the Hyperjuice battery to power your MacBook via the modified MagSafe cable. And if you need to charge while you're on the road, the kit also comes with a car adapter. Now again, Sanho Digital did all the wire configurations and setup for us. And if you decide to order the Magic Box Hyperjuice battery combo, they actually offer the option of doing it for you as well. They'll even provide you with a pre-modified MagSafe power adapter so you don't have to cut yours up. However, if you did want to do all the modifications yourself, the Magic Box Kit also comes with a pair of wire strippers and full step-by-step -step instructions on how to do so. Well, that pretty much covers it. Again, I was hoping to do the full-on demo for you guys, but if you do want to check it out for yourself, we have a video that shows it all right on our blog. And for more details on the Magic Box and its accompanying Hyperjuice battery pack, log on to our website at gearaddicts.com. I'm Keiko Lingus, and I'll check you guys out next time. Hey guys, thanks again for watching. For even more videos from Gear Addicts, be sure to subscribe to us right here on our YouTube channel. And for more information on the product featured in this video, click on the link in the description below. I'll catch you guys next time.